with that, I'm going to turn it over to Richmond Select Board member David Sander. Thank you. Welcome and good morning. When I started my stent on the select board, uh, I was soon made aware of the huge problem that existed on this field we're on today. Uh, this, this property sat vacant for 20 years. The building was collapsing. Uh, the building literally ceased to function as a business overnight. Uh, people just walked away and left it. There was no cleanup, there was no remediation. The building was literally collapsing in on itself. The roof had fallen in, the walls were falling in. Uh, local uh, younger people, I will say, were coming in and smoking cigarettes and uh, just tossing the butts next to piles of pallets and papers and uh, scrap wood, uh, literally hanging out over cantilevering beams that were just suspended in midair. The building was literally collapsing on itself. There were no fences keeping people out. Uh, as the town was aware of the problem, we tried many things to mediate it, but we, we didn't have the resources uh, to, to safely secure the site. Uh, and it's, it was a problem that we weren't able to solve, and it was only through the collaboration with Buttermilk and applying for the, the public-private funding that we were able to start the found, found foundation of getting where we are today. Uh, so this is a very successful day, a very uh, a day that Richmond should be happy and thankful for. Uh, it was a long trip to get here, uh, but it was only possible through teamwork and collaboration uh, from a governor who reaches across party lines and helps when, uh, when principles are, are more important than politics and getting problems solved. To the creative developers who look at the, the situation and wonder, how can we make this work instead of looking at the long list of reasons why it wouldn't work? Uh, working with a town that was anxious to get this turned around and becoming a vibrant part of the community again, uh, removing the liability and the hazard that was here. So we all deserve a pat on the back today. Uh, and I want to thank you all for coming and being a part of this great celebration. Thank you.